Hello everyone, Dracovich here. So I wanted to make a follow-up video to the one where I was talking about censorship on the Reddit forum. Because today, 17 hours ago, a message from the moderators. They said, Hey everyone, the recent events surrounding PSN linking, balance changes, war bonds, and developer interactions have made moderating the subreddit a challenge. Here are some clarifications and challenges we will be hopefully making... We will hopefully make visiting Hell Divers a more enjoyable experience. So they said a bi-weekly mega thread. To clean up the sub and discussion, we will be instituting a bi-weekly mega thread for discussion around the current state of the game and most recent warban. This will be to encourage discussion in a localized space and diminish diminish mass posting on the same topics. When this goes into effect, we will be more active in removing repeat posts and spam about the same subject, and we'll be redirecting these posts to the mega thread. So they're going to censor all repeat posts and spam about the same subject. Which it just seems like more censorship to me, but... We will also be looking at posting more focused mega threads in the future when popular or divisive topics come up. We understand what you guys are upset about. It's not just you. We are a varied group of players and we have different opinions about the state of the game. Ideas about that should or should not be allowed on the subreddit and we communicate with each other civilly every day to come into a unified consensus for moderation. We expect you all to do the same. Now I just want to make a little comment here. I was posting videos about Helldivers, like the gods on the weapons. And I was getting censored. So, like, all this stuff. Like, I, that doesn't even make sense to me. Like, why did I get censored? <laughs> Rule number one, be civil. We want everyone to be able to voice their opinions about the game. And we don't want to remove them. However, if you backload your posted opinions with foul language, insults, subtle personal tasks, etc. We have the right to remove your opinions. We do, don't want to do that. Something to consider when you post or comment. This is what I don't like, see? This this rule one right here, this gives them unlimited power to decide who is being personally attacked, who's using insults, who's using foul language. This is something like the government would do to like uh, censor your free speech, you know? This isn't a place to discuss your opinions or other topics. There are other subreddits for that. Wow, right? Additionally, this rule has been expanded to include not safe for work content and discussions of illegal activity. Naming and shaming. We believe that when the developers, Arrowhead commu employees communicate in public, these topics are now open for discussion. You are allowed to post and discuss the content of what was said, but you are not allowed to negatively focus on the person who said it. When you delve into attacking the human that said the words you're discussing, you shift into naming and shaming witch hunting. Calling for an employee to be fired violates this rule. Additionally, we have instituted a new rule. Rule 15. Submissions must be in English. This rule is instated to give our users and moderation teams a consistent language and to prevent miscommunication or abuse. That seems like uh, a little bit ridiculous too. But anyway, a little clarity about who we are. We are not Arrowhead employees, and our communication with Arrowhead has been extremely minimal. But they were hired by Arrowhead. But that being said, Arrowhead is not a company that ex has expertise in hiring moderators. So I'm going to forgive Arrowhead here for hiring these terrible moderators. But I wanted to know that these are terrible moderators, okay? Just let's just be clear about that right now. And it might be because it's Reddit and Reddit has a lot of rules and they're just following the Reddit rules. And in that case, Reddit is horrible. But anyway, a little clarity about who we are. We are not Arrowhead employees and our communication with Arrowhead has been very extremely minimal. Many of you that participate in the official discord have had interactions with the developers that we have had. Speaking of which, we also have no affiliation with the Discord and cannot revert any bans there. Best we can do is send you the appeal form. A few Arrowhead employees have 
or have had mods rights so that they may create sticky posts to communicate with you or to share information. But none of them will be moderating you or any of your posts slash comments. So my anger towards Arrowhead might have been a little bit wrongly directed, but at the same time, they did hire these people and they're not doing anything about censorship. Okay. So at the same time, I'm still mad at Arrowhead, but most of the blame is going to these moderators for me. To handle the massive amount of moderating work that comes with having 1.2 million users, we have added some new moderators. BR Perry, Ver- Veruz, Walder, Ashen Fox, and Davis92. These guys were unlucky enough to come in right before the major storm and they hit the ground sprinting. The amount of time and effort they have already put in for you is astounding. Oh yeah, it's all for me. I, I love getting banned from Reddit and censored. If you have any questions, please ask them in the comments and we will be answering them. So, 15 hours ago, so they posted, so two hours after this post, they commented, this topic is very controversial, obviously, people don't like being censored. It really was never our intention for there to be censorship. So, it was never our intention for there to be censorship. You know why that's important? Because I've been calling them out on censorship. And they deleted my post. And then they talk about it themselves. So by their own rules, they should be kicked out of their Discord. Right? Fair is fair. But anyway. Or for it to be used for censorship, which it is. And you just increased the rules and the censorship. When Sony when the Sony situation started, we didn't remove anything related to it, and we didn't create a mega thread, even though we had a lot of people asking for it. The subreddit became chaotic, but it was for the greater good. So we totally understand that the post needed to be seen, and not buried beneath a sub a mega thread. The moderators will discuss and evaluate concerns of the community. The subreddit has grown too large and too fast, so we're still learning how to handle it. The entire nearly 1.3 million subscribers are just from the past two months, and even though the subreddit is 10 years old at this point, the Helldivers 1 community was a small fraction. So this is entirely new territory for us. Nearly every post on our subreddit that ends up on the front page ends up on the front page of our all. So we have to be very careful with some content, because even if 1% of our population dogpiles on top of an Arrowhead employee... Reddit admins will come after us for not stopping a witch hunt, even if the employees are acting like dicks on their Discord. Like, what the hell? They're calling the employees dicks, right? They're calling us witch hunters, even though we're not witch hunting. Like, these people actually said these things, right? So I, already, I don't like the way this guy's talking. And even if we all agree the balancing is horrible... So he's talking shit about the game now. It's a very slippery slope. Man, I hope this guy gets fired. We just want this community to be able to voice their opinions, but you still need to follow the rules on Reddit. Not every discussion about this game needs to be positive. If the game falls short to express your frustration at the game, thank you. So, all that being said, I'm going to ask a question now. Why were my videos banned? They told me it was self-promotion. Okay, I didn't even type anything except for the link to the video. I think a lot of this stuff that they're talking about is going to be entirely down to them, who they don't like, who they want to get rid of, what things they don't want to be seen. Like anything talking bad about them gets deleted. Anything talking about bad about the game was getting deleted until recently. Any, like anything that makes people mad... They delete it so they don't have to moderate it, see? So anyway, that's the controversy from the moderators. The whole reason for me going over this video is I think I'm going to start making videos for Hell Divers again. I'm still completely upset at Sony. I think Sony is a horrible publisher. Hopefully they get their shit together soon. Arrowhead 
is a small company of 100 people. They made some terrible decisions, and they made some terrible hiring decisions, including moderators and community managers. But I'm willing to forgive that if they actually try to, to fix it. What I see right here is them making it worse. But the one thing I did take out of this message is it's the moderators that are horrible and not the devs. So I'm going to give them another chance. I'm going to start making Helldivers 2 videos again. I'm not going to, I'm not going to deal with the Reddit. I'm just going to read what people said and not compost anything. You can see I'm still banned for two days for having posted my YouTube videos on the Reddit. It's insane. I got a full Reddit ban for seven days on everything. Can't comment on anything. That's not really fair to me, honestly, but I'm going to start making Reddit Helldivers 2 videos again because you guys don't deserve to have something taken away from you when you didn't do anything. But, uh, yeah, I just want to let you guys know what's going on, talk about where I'm, where I'm at, what I'm going to do next. Honestly, as soon as Ark Raiders or Ship Jump comes out, I'm probably going to hop over to that game because those games look pretty sweet. And hopefully they ran a little bit better than what's been going on. But anyway, I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and share and follow and all those good things. And I'm going to start posting more often. Well, not more often, but more often about Helldivers. And I'm going to start going through uh, Weapon Gods and stuff again. So, uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.